what's up squaddies how are you doing welcome back to our youtube channel welcome back to another video and today we have some breaking news royal family website updates what's behind prince harry and Meghan markle's separate bio removal um in a notable revision to the royal family's official website um the individual biographies of prince harry and Meghan markle the duke and duchess of sussex have been amalgamated into a single profile um so what's behind prince harry and Meghan markle's um separate bio removal um the alteration highlighted on the royal.uk website underscores a significant shift in the portrayal of the couple within the royal fold and i agree the update on the royal.uk website obviously draws our attention to the fact that harry and Meghan are no longer working royals it draws our attention to the fact that harry and Meghan stepped back from being you know working royals so obviously um their status in the royal fold have changed you know there is no way um it was expected that after them stepping back that their status would still them that their status would still be the same you know we know that prince harry doesn't use his royal highness you know because he stepped back from being a working royal so this was honestly expected yeah from from the word go this was expected it's just that it didn't happen sooner the change initially spotted by fan blog guts royals um comes as a conspicuous alteration to the online representation of the duke and duchess of sussex this follows their decision to step back from royal duties in 2020 as emphasized in a statement featured on the website yes 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 and this 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 is absolutely true that yes it it shows us and you know it's like the the physical manifestation of harry and Meghan stepping back from being working royals in the website you know because they had not you know like reflected this a hundred percent on the website but now i feel like they have gotten the chance to do that which honestly believe is completely okay i have no issue with you know with the royals doing whatever they did i have no issue um the statement clarifies their royal departure the statement prominently featured on the updated page reaffirms prince harry's and Meghan markle's transition away from active roles within the royal family it cites their marriage in 2018 and acknowledges their children prince archie and princess lilibet while underlining their departure from official duties absolutely yeah like from the top they're telling us that harry and megan stopped being working royals you know back in 2020 it also tells us about their marriage you know and the fact that they have two children prince archie and princess lilibet and i feel like um the reason the reason why harry still has you know like has a section on the royal website is because he was born into this family you know he was born with the royal status and no matter what the royals do no matter how much they try to cut him off to cut him down he is a royal and that remains a fact you know and i feel like we always keep repeating this statement especially when people start attacking him you know why are you using the you know the duke and duchess of sussex titles why are you doing this you know it's because he was born into this you know basically being a royal is a birthright to him so um him still having a position on the royal website is proof of that you know um and also it's proof regarding the kids you know be, regarding princess lilibet and prince archie that they were born into this this is their birthright honestly you know so there is no way no matter what happens you know no matter what the royals do no matter what the british media does harry and Meghan will keep being the, the duke and duchess of sussex um archie and lilibet will keep being prince 
Archie and Princess Lilibet of Sussex. The revamped biography provides insights into the individual accomplishments of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Also, I feel like the part that is theirs in their website it highlights to us who is Prince Harry, you know, who is. Meghan Markle, you know, it tells us more about them, you know, about their marriage, about their kids. Um, it tells us about their accomplishments, you know, both as working royals, because you know, it clearly states what they did as working royals, you know, their major accomplishments, and also tells us about them as individuals, you know, without being directly related to the royals. Who are they? You know, for example, it, it highlights Meghan Markle's career as an actor, which she didn't do as a royal. Um, under the heading about the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, the page highlights Harry's involvement in organizing the Invictus Games and his extensive international engagements on behalf of the monarchy. Yes, what he did for the monarchy, but also what he as an individual did. Because we know Harry started the Invictus Games as Harry, not as Harry on behalf of the Queen. He did that as Prince Harry. Um, similarly, Meghan's contributions are detailed uh, under about the Duchess of Sussex, focusing on her patronage on various in, um, organizations during her tenure as working member of the royal family. This includes her support for the National Theatre, the Association of Commonwealth Universities, SmartWorks, and the Mayhew Animal Welfare Charity. Um, um, it also talks about the titles bestowed by Queen Elizabeth II. The biography also clarifies that the titles Duke and Duchess of Sussex were bestowed upon Harry and Meghan by Queen Elizabeth II upon their wedding day, reaffirming their status within the royal lineage despite their altered roles. Absolutely. You know what we said in the beginning, that no matter what happens, no matter sh the shifts that has happened, in terms of you know what they are committed to currently you know even them not being working royals it still doesn't change the fact that Harry and Meghan are royals it doesn't change the fact that Harry was born a royal and being a royal is his birthright it is in his blood basically you know it also doesn't change the fact that Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet of Sussex are royals and it is in their blood, no matter how much distance is placed between them and the royals. So yes, I agree that um, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex titles reaffirm their status within the royal lineage despite their altered roles. Um, uh, ongoing representation on royal.uk, the amalgamation of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's biographies on the official royal website not only signifies an official update on their status but also provides a consolidated portrayal of their contribution and affiliation within the monarchy absolutely and there are so many people who are saying that um, th because their biographies have been reduced, because their biographies have been um, combined, it reflects on who Harry and Meghan are, you know, but that's a complete lie. Because the purpose of Royal.UK website is to give details about people regarding their service to the monarchy, you know, and for now we know that Harry and Meghan are not serving the monarchy no more. You know, we know that Harry and Meghan left as working royals, so it's absolutely okay for their for their biographies to be reduced and only highlight what they did for the monarchy. Of course, there are other bits regarding who they are, but majorly I feel like it has highlighted what they have done for the monarchy. Although it has not gone into details, it has just given, you know, um summaries here and there. I feel like it's it's okay. It's it's okay. However long it is, it's okay. And in addition to that, it has also given um, 
a link to sussex.com which was great you know because what if i want to know more about harry and megan what if i want to know more about what harry and megan have been up to since they left the royal family you can click on that link and get all the information you need regarding harry and megan what they have been doing and what they are currently doing honestly actually i feel like this update on royal.uk has happened at the right time you know because it has happened right after Meghan markle and prince harry have updated their sussex.com website you know um it has happened you know right after they have revamped it it has happened right after harry and Meghan have created a platform where you can get every kind of information you want regarding them so yeah to anyone who wants to know more about her and Megan just click on sussex.com and you'll find everything that you need regarding them yeah so so that's it that's it from me to you and until the next video bye bye